Hi, everybody. Craig Shacklett from UR Compt here, and I've got a very special guest. I'm very excited to talk about Virgin Voyage's new Sea Roller Casino Rewards Program. Did I say it right, Leah? Yes, Sea Roller. The Sea Roller. And I'm here with Leah Gregori, the Manager of Casino Business Development with Virgin Voyages. Leah, thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me, Craig. Hey, it's a pleasure. I always look forward every time I get a chance to talk to you. And now we've got a, a great reason to talk, and that is to talk about the Sea Roller Rewards and all kinds of other exciting new developments with the Virgin Voyages Casino Program. So when we start with uh, the Sea Roller Rewards, what may walk us through what are the different tiers to start with? Okay, so we started out with five tiers. Our first tier is called Showstopper. That's anybody who's new to the Virgin brand. So once you get to 5,000 points, you're going to bump up to a star. Star is going to go from 5,000 to 14,999. Then you're going to go to a superstar. That goes from 15,000 to 34,999. Idol, which goes from 35,000 up to 74,999. And then that very elite level of legend, which is 75,000 plus points. And that's our tears. I love it. I love the the theme, the kind of rock star theme to go along with like your suites, the rock star suites and everything. So that's very cool. So um, what are like at a high level, what are some of the benefits? It seems like star is where they really start to kick in. Um, yes, may walk us through some of the high level benefits. Okay. So when you get up to a superstar, an idol and a legend, you're going to receive free play, um, little free play when you come on board. So when you book your, your voyage with us, you will also include some free play. You'll receive premium Wi-Fi, the upgraded Wi-Fi on board at the Idol and Legend. And anybody that's above Showstopper is going to receive a free cruise every year. Oh, that's great. And so how long like how do people earn uh these different rewards like what what's the time period to kind of level up okay well we started with um we looked back at everybody uh, back until january of 2023 and looked at their points and that's how we assigned the tier you're going to continue with that tier for a year um but if you or if you level up which i just with all the different numbers which you can find on our website as well of where you need to be for your points to get to your next level you will when you level up you'll receive a email telling you you are now at the next level once you get to that level you are good for another year so you have 12 months to earn the level and then you get to have it for 12 months and our period goes from May 1st till April 30th. Perfect. So a lot of people I know because you know we got inundated, I know your team got inundated as well, that Virgin already notified people that qualified from in that window from January 2023 till uh, May of this year. So a lot of people already got notified what tier status they're in. Now they have until April 30th of 2025, if they qualify again, then they are that status through 2026, right? Through yes, April 2026. Okay, yes. perfect. Now, the obvious next question, once you list all the points, 5,000 to get to star, for example, 75,000 to get to legend, is how do you earn points? Maybe you can walk us through what, you know, how much it takes through a slot machine or whatever to earn a point. Okay, so yes, on a regular slot machine, um it takes five dollars in earns you one point on any video poker machine ten dollars will earn you one point on table games it's a little different it's based on your average bet your length of play and the number of hands or rolls of course if you're playing roulette or or dice so that's how you're going to earn your points now if somebody's on a cruise and they want to see how many points they've earned like at, up to that point what how can they do that 
Um, we had a casino host on a floor on every one of our, you know, on all of our ships. We all, they also can call sailor services, the casino sailor services after their trip, and they can tell them, or they can stop by sailor services um, on board. Perfect. And I know the UR Comp members are, are all very savvy. They understand how points work. But just just be clear, uh, 5,000 points at $5 for in a slot machine to earn a point doesn't mean you have to lose 25,000 to earn 5,000 points. It's just cycling through the machine. So when you're hitting exactly. it, exactly. When you're hitting exactly. it, it's, you know, you're winning some, you're losing some, winning some, it's bouncing around. But every time you're hitting the, uh, let's say it's a dollar, a dollar a spin, five spins, whether you win or lose, you're earning that point. Right. Every time the money goes through, you're getting a point. Perfect. Okay. So, um, and then this is a question that uh, I, I know has come up. Are there any like tier matching or anything like that from other cruise lines or casino loyalty programs? Um, not at this time. We did just roll our program out. So, you know, we will reevaluate as we go along. But at this time, we are not doing any tier matches for our other cruise lines. And one more question, because I know a lot of um, UR comp members are trying Virgin for the first time. I've loved that they get the you know, free drinks in the casino while they're playing on their first trip. So um, as of right now, and hopefully in the foreseeable future, UR comp members, are they coming in and still getting those, I guess it would be kind of star benefits on their first trip? Absolutely. We love our UR comp members. And we love, you know, so they absolutely will receive that when they come on board. Now, um, and that is at least until May of next year. They will receive their waived fees. They'll receive their complimentary drinks on the floor. So they will still be getting the same treatment as they've gotten since they started um, with Virgin. Beautiful. Okay. And so as players um, play, they earn status, they get the annual trip. Um, what's the best way for people to book those, those cruises? The best way to book that cruise is through your UR comp host. All right. And I'm not paying Leah to say that. So thank you, Leah. No, That's... he did not pay me to say that. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. And then, uh, certificates. So I know, um, you know, that was something that initially when Virgin first came out, a lot of players were like, where's my certificate? Um, we weren't. Uh, Virgin wasn't sending those out at the beginning, but now uh, you are. And so maybe you could give us a little insight into like how to earn a certificate from play on board. Well, you earn a certificate by um, earning 8,000 points um, on your voyage. And there are specific um, voyages that you can choose from. Again, you can call and book that with your UR comp host. Or um, they can book it for you and they can just, you know, they can take care of that. Awesome. And I know uh, we've talked about some that you're very excited and we are excited about too is a uh, a portal that's in the work. So maybe you can give us a little sneak preview on, on what's on the horizon. We are working on a portal that all of our sailors will be able to access to check their points and what offers they have available. Um, this is in the works. I don't have a date for it yet, but we are working on making it much easier for the sailors to see where they stand with, with Virgin Voyages. Beautiful. Okay. Now that uh, the Players Club is launched, uh, what can we expect to come from Virgin next? Well, we are super excited. We are actually putting together a high limit room on the Valiant Lady. We're going to start with her. It will be off the casino. It's not attached to the actual casino, but it'll have five table games and 20 slot machines. Um, yes, there'll be beverage service in the room as well. And it'll be for our, our higher limit customers to have a little more privacy and to give us a little more gaming space. So we're very excited about it. We plan to launch the first sailing in October on the Valiant Lady. That is very exciting. I know we've got quite a few players that like to uh, play in the high limit room. So that's great. And also, I mean, the Virgin Casino is always popping. So just any extra space is gonna be very welcome. Right, 
And we also are going to have those favorite machines in there, the Buffalo machines. Um, and there's a couple others that we're getting in there. So stay tuned. I'll get you the update as soon as we know the exact ones. I love that. Okay. And then what about new ships? I mean, you guys have been on fire. Everybody loves booking Virgin. Um, yeah. What are, what are plans for new ships or new itineraries coming up? Well, we have, um, we did announce that the Brilliant is going to launch in September of 2025. She's going to start out of New York. She's going to do some Bermuda sailings. She's going to do a few Canada sailings. She is then going to come down to Miami. She's going to hang out in Miami for a while. She's going to do um, our first Panama Canal crossing and go over to the West Coast. She's going to do some trips out of Los Angeles. And she's also going to do some trips to Alaska. Wow. So that's going to be the first virgin ship to be on the west coast is that right that is right how exciting i know it's going to kill it the virgin brand is popular everywhere and i know there's a lot of pent-up demand on the west coast i know that we're going to book a lot of you uh, comp members on it that's for nice sure. we appreciate that like i said we're really excited about about her um her maiden voyage and the different itineraries that we are going to add which we'll probably add a few other ones in too but if you check out our website, uh, some of her actual itineraries are on there um, now. Perfect. Well, Leah, this has been great. I really appreciate you carving out some time to let us know about the new Sea Roller program. And I look forward to seeing a lot of URCOM members climbing up the ranks and hopefully getting to that legend status. Absolutely. Thank you, Craig. Appreciate you taking the time to talk to me. All right. Well, I'll see you on board. Okay, sounds good.